You won't believe that these nine extremely rich NBA players live like average Joes. From using coupons to driving vintage cars, these players choose frugality to focus on more important things in life. Number 9. Matthew Dellavedova – $1,000,000 dollars. Matthew Dellavedova is a big deal in the basketball world. He's not just won the NBA but Olympic medals as well, and has played over 500 NBA games. But his lifestyle is not like many of us might have expected. According to sources, before the game, Matthew goes out looking for free food. Yep, you heard that right. For example, when playing for the Cleveland Cavaliers, he left his team's room in the big Staples Center to find some free food. He didn't do this because he was broke. The guy is a millionaire with a net worth of $1 million. His intentions were simple, he's just a down-to-earth guy. He credits his upbringing and family values with grounding him. Matthew Dellavedova's parents, Mark and Leanne, set an example of hard work. His father drives buses and deals with land development, while his mother is a schoolteacher. So unlike him, they were not millionaires, they had to work hard for their families. His parents spent countless hours driving young Matthew to games when he played for Maryborough and Bendigo. And they even bought plane tickets and accompanied him so he could play in tournaments. Now Matthew wants to give back to them. He's looking forward to taking care of his parents and repaying them for all the hours and sacrifices they made for him and his sisters. So it doesn't matter if he doesn't get fancy meals, he just wants to stick to his roots. Just like Matthew Dellavedova, the next NBA player prefers his family's comfort over extravagance. Number 8. Herbert Jones – $5 million New Orleans Pelicans' Herbert Jones is raking in some good cash and has a fortune of $5 million. But did you know that he likes getting his clothes for free? Shocking, right? He is entirely the opposite of many NBA stars who have a stylist to pick their clothes for them. Herbert is not the one to follow that path. He prefers to rock the comfy gear provided by his team, the New Orleans Pelicans. You're probably wondering why he does that. Well, he wears Pelicans gear not to show off, but because he wants to save money. He's more concerned about his family and their well-being. He doesn't care what people think about how he looks as long as his family is doing better. What a family-oriented guy. Plus, he's fine with being careful with his money to make sure that his family will be fine in the future. He thinks about his children and even his grandchildren being able to get a good education without gathering debt because of what he earned in the NBA. But his thriftiness is not just about his clothes. Surprisingly, he still drives the same car he had in college, a 2018 Dodge Charger, and he plans to keep on using it until it stops running. For now, he's happy as his trusty car still gets him to the gym. Herbert's mantra is quite simple, save more than you spend, and he doesn't hold back on sharing that wisdom with others. He often suggests his teammates do the same thing. He loves to joke with them about their spending habits and then reminds them to start saving. In reply, they tell him that he'll make plenty of money and should have a good time, but he knows he's being smart. Herbert Jones's life motto is pretty inspiring, and the next NBA star on our list has an equally unique way of living. Number 7. Trey Burke – $6 million The point guard for the Dallas Mavericks, Trey Burke, came back to the team in 2020 after a short time with the 76ers. His salary for the 2020-21 season was $3 million, but when he was with the 76ers, he earned only $229,220. Even though Trey makes a lot of money, he's not a big spender like many other players. In fact, he actually sets budgets for himself. He limits himself to spending just five grand per month. According to Trey, this helps him stay humble and live like an average middle-class American. And this has a lot to do with his upbringing in a working-class family. When he made it to the pros, he hired financial managers to help him handle his money. That was a smart move. Money does get to your head sometimes. Even the NBA teaches young players how to manage their finances, and his old team, the Utah Jazz, also gave him extra guidance. Trey's financial discipline is impressive, considering he has a net worth of about $6 million and could easily spend more, but he chooses to be responsible with his money. Our next NBA player has a net worth that is double that of Trey's, and yet he also lives like an average Joe. Number 6. 
Matt Bonner, $12 million. The former Toronto Raptors player Matt Bonner was quite the star in his day. He also had the honor of winning two NBA championships with the Spurs. But it's not just his career that makes him the talk of the town. No, he is often the subject of discussion because of his humble lifestyle. Despite having a net worth of around $12 million, he keeps his expenses low. To understand why he does that, it's important to talk a bit about his backstory. His financial struggles in his younger years influenced his frugal lifestyle. Living in Europe with very little money taught him to be financially responsible. When he lived in Toronto, he didn't even have a car. He just didn't think he needed it in a city that has good public transportation. People often saw him on the bus or train on his way to the basketball arena downtown. According to Matt, if he still lived and worked downtown, he might never have owned a car. However, when he moved to San Antonio, it got a little harder to avoid it, so he gave in and bought his first car. Can you guess which car he bought? If you're expecting something flashy, you're gonna be disappointed. Matt Bonner got his hands on a 2006 Pontiac Grand Prix, and he went all the way to New Hampshire so that he could avoid paying extra taxes on it. And he still drives the same car he got when he started in the NBA. He could have bought lots of expensive cars, but he didn't fall down that rabbit hole. When we told you that he's good at money saving, we meant it. Another way he avoids paying more is by saying no to extra chicken when he stops for lunch at Subway. The NBA star doesn't want to pay the additional $2. He even used to wear low-cost sneakers until he bagged a deal for free ones. Nothing beats free shoes when it comes to saving money. Matt has a thoughtful life philosophy. He believes that the best things in life are free. Even today, he enjoys his solar-powered Casio watch just as much as a fancy Rolex. His Casio has a stopwatch and an alarm, so it does the job. Matt thinks that having a fancy Rolex would mean not having an alarm or stopwatch. Both these things are essential for his routine. His watch might look a bit 80s, but it makes him feel nostalgic and warm inside. The plus point is that it's solar-powered, so no worries if the battery dies. Our next basketball player had a tough early life, similar to Matt Bonner, which influenced some of his habits. Number 5. Jimmy Butler – $80 million Jimmy Butler stepped into the NBA spotlight with the Chicago Bulls in 2011. Soon, he became a fan favorite as many people noticed his impressive talent. Things were going really well. Throughout his career, he made some really great money and has a staggering net worth of $80 million. However, it wasn't always like this. Life was not always a sweet dream for him. His early life was difficult. Tragically, he lost his parents when he was just a teenager. After that, life was tough for him, but basketball became his safe place. Those days taught him some valuable lessons and instilled discipline in him. He kept the values close to his heart and made sure never to forget his humble beginnings. Even at the peak of his career, Jimmy tried to follow a modest lifestyle. During the NBA Finals, instead of ordering coffee, he had a coffee machine in his hotel room. And if any of his teammates asked for it, he would charge them $20 for a cup. So he wasn't just cutting down on his own expenses, he was earning some money too. Interestingly, his love for coffee was the driving force behind his coffee brand, Big Face Coffee. Jimmy also helps others, and he's a huge supporter of charities that provide for needy kids and families. His giving spirit comes from his own past. He understands how important it is to uplift others, just like someone did for him. I guess he thinks that's a more important thing to spend money on. Coming up next is an NBA star who has the exact same net worth as Jimmy and he's just as careful with his spending. Number 4. Kawhi Leonard – $80 million Kawhi Leonard is not your typical NBA star, and he's not a fan of stardom. He even prefers to stay out of the association's spotlight and focuses only on the game. And the most surprising thing is that even though he's got a fortune of $80 million, he's not a big spender. He was super easy to spot for years because he used to drive around in a vintage car, a 1997 Chevy Tahoe. It was the same car he'd had since he was a teenager. He nicknamed it Gas Guzzler. Even after eight years into his NBA career, he still drove the Gas Guzzler. 
and that car was only worth a tiny fraction of his yearly salary. Someone once asked him why he still drove that old car, and he replied that it worked fine and he liked that he didn't owe any money on it. Finally, in 2016, he decided that it was time for an upgrade. Nowadays, he does own a Porsche, but you'll rarely see him taking it out for a spin. Here's another fact about Kawhi that you might not know. He is also an avid coupon collector and loves to use them whenever he goes out to eat. He's a sponsor for Wingstop, a chicken wing restaurant, and he doesn't mind eating down there even though he's a millionaire. As part of his deal with Wingstop, he gets free coupons to eat there all over the US. He considers that a huge perk. Even after Kawhi signed a huge $94 million contract, he still used those coupons. Some of his teammates reported that if he ever lost them during road trips, he would panic. But lucky for him, when that happens, Wingstop just sends him some more. Next on our list is another NBA star player who doesn't mind living like an average Joe. His focus is more on long-term goals. Number 3. Draymond Green – $90 million Draymond Green is an accomplished basketball player with an impressive career in the NBA. He's won the NBA championship four times and has been an NBA All-Star four times too. Moreover, he's also been on the All-NBA team twice and has two Olympic gold medals. His brilliant career helped him make a massive fortune of about 90 mil. When Draymond first joined the Golden State Warriors, he had to leave his home in Michigan, where he had lived for 22 years. He asked his new teammates where to live in the Bay Area and decided to pick a unique yet simple apartment in Emeryville. Draymond could have selected a posh place to live, but he didn't. He made a sensible decision. Unlike most NBA rookies, Draymond is careful with his money. During the Las Vegas Summer League, he ate small meals to save some of his cash. Draymond even shops at budget-friendly stores like Pack and Save, and he's focused on maintaining his financial stability. He has a laid-back approach to life because of the hardships he's faced. Draymond is forward-thinking and knows that basketball won't last forever, so he takes his financial future seriously. He aims to become a billionaire by the time he's 40. To achieve this goal, he's already making smart investments and planning for his life beyond basketball. Similar to Draymond Green, the next NBA player is big on saving for the future. Number 2. Carmelo Anthony – $170 million The NBA veteran Carmelo Anthony was powerful and successful. He made it to the NBA All-Star team 10 times and was chosen for the All-NBA team 6 times. Now everyone is a fan of keeping some cash in their wallet, right? And you might not expect that from someone like Carmelo, especially when he has a huge net worth of $170 million, but he deserves his spot on this list. Even when he was playing for the Oklahoma City Thunder and New York Knicks, where he earned a reasonable sum of money, he didn't forget to save. He has a practical habit for saving some cash. He's a big fan of using coupons to get some good discounts. Carmelo's frugality is real. He looks for coupons in Sunday newspapers to catch deals at the supermarket. Just imagine how store clerks react when they catch on to who he is and see how he manages his money. Carmelo once shared that people at the store stared at him in confusion, not understanding why a millionaire like him was doing that. But Carmelo is just like us. He's down to earth and humble, even though he has all that fame and fortune. He reminds everyone that he too is a human, a regular guy who likes to save a few bucks here and there. Carmelo is relatable, which is one of the reasons why his fans love him. He's far from being the richest player on our list though. The frugal player in our number one spot might shock you, because he's not just a millionaire anymore. Number 1. LeBron James – $1.1 billion LeBron James is the highest scorer ever in the NBA and is at the top of our list. But you're probably shocked to see him on this list, since he's one of the richest NBA players of all time. We know it's unbelievable to see someone with a net worth of 1.1 bill living like an average Joe, but he does. Despite having the means to buy anything he desires, this legend is quite money conscious. LeBron James is not as extravagant with his money as some of his fellow athletes. Instead of an expensive sports car, he drives a Kia, and sometimes he doesn't even take it out of the garage.
People have seen him riding a bike to practice. He thinks cycling has its benefits. First, he stays in good shape. Second, he saves some money on gas. Lastly, it's an environmentally friendly practice. What a guy! To be fair, LeBron James doesn't keep all that money in the bank. He's a well-known philanthropist who gives millions to charities every year. On the flip side, he's quite thrifty in his personal matters. Back in 2017, Dwayne Wade, LeBron's former Miami Heat teammate, gave him the nickname the cheapest man in the NBA during an ESPN interview, and LeBron just chuckled in response. His teammates have also shared an interesting story about him. He avoids using his phone's mobile data plan and connects to the internet instead. He lives like a poor college student, hopping between Wi-Fi spots. Now, the average American cell phone bill is around $70. And technically, that's nothing when you have a billion dollars. But it's still $70 more he can save, I guess. And it doesn't end there. While he was with the Cleveland Cavaliers, some of LeBron's teammates noticed that he stuck to the free version of Spotify for his music. So, the locker room's music often got interrupted by ads because he didn't want to pay a few bucks each month for the premium subscription. LeBron James uses another music app, Pandora, for his playlist, but he doesn't have a subscription to that either. Instead of splurging money, he makes some smart moves. For example, he invests his money wisely in things like wellness, movies, and restaurants. This makes him a clever entrepreneur. So, you see, it's not always the materialistic things that bring happiness. But it isn't just the NBA players who prefer a simple life. Surprisingly, many billionaires have adopted the same approach. Watch our video, 15 Billionaires Who Live Like Average Joes, to find out who we have on the list.